I just got off the phone with one of my sisters and an insight came up that I wanted to share with all of you. First, look at this color. I have an autumn color palette and this kind of pumpkin-y rust color is like so good on me. And then I put a little matching eyeshadow. Um, so my sister is a soft natural body type and we were helping her find an outfit for a holiday party. And this is one of my favorite things to do is to help my friends, sisters, girlfriends find outfits for particular events. And she said, I've really come to understand that my uniform is a fitted top and high-waisted wide leg pants. That's where I feel comfortable. And I said, okay, so, like, so we're going to take this to the next level, find something dressy with that template. So she ended up finding this outfit that was, and I'll post a photo, like full on sparkle disco ball version of that. And it was in her color palette and she looked incredible. And in the photos that she posted, she looks like in her element where she's playful, but sophisticated. And she said, I just felt like, I felt like myself. And the, the particular comment she made was when you can wear something kind of wild, but if it's meant for you, it doesn't look out of place. And this is something I talk about a lot for soft dramatics in particular, we can wear something really glamorous and elegant and not look out of place. And for her, it was like a slightly different version of that, but the same principle applies where she just looked at home on her. Another example is a friend of mine who is a gameen, and gameens are the types that, have you ever seen a girl that can wear like a Mickey Mouse graphic t-shirt and look cool? That's, that's likely a gameen. I, like, I look deranged and things like that. And she sent me a photo of a pair of slippers that she got that I can imagine full body how cool these look on her. And my response to her was, those are amazing. I would look like I belong in a mental institution if I wore those. People would be like, are you okay? Um, and that also, for body types, they're really not just about bone structure and proportions. It's also about essence. And something about, because even in that photo of just her feet, I could picture how cool she looked in those. And that has more to do with her essence than her structure it's her feet you know and then i got to thinking about why why is there a body type system why do people fit into boxes nobody likes to be in a box and i think it's when you observe nature nature first of all can't help itself but be beautiful and adorn itself and express itself through beauty it just can't help itself it also likes patterns, it likes seasons, it likes cycles. And that's why I think it is not confining to have archetypes, systems, patterns with infinite variability within those systems. They're guides, they're frames, they're a sense of how things apply to the order of everything but again with infinite variation so even going back to her simple outfit template fitted top wide leg pants high waist infinite variations to that thing that works for her and then nature goes outside the pattern sometimes too and that works too so it isn't about boxing in but harmonizing mm, that's just the best word i can use to describe finding, like aligning with your essence is just feeling in harmony. So I, I hope that resonates. I just, that was really sitting with me right now and I wanted to share that immediately. Mm -hmm.